Take me slow, let me know, should I stay or go, would you please let me know?
love who I'm gonna situation tricky But I still got the nerve Kuwa kikisha that you feel me Still up above Don't no kuweka Do you see me? You a star telescope Don't need me Jaza ka hamsini Astrology in the luga But my pains in the yodini Not to mind It's not a moment That is passing by Briefly ka wembuku Weju wanga kwangu Masomo ndi msingi But to reach an understanding Of your scriptures I am living To cheze kama sisi Wengine rules wanyiti Maybe against the world Kuchocha kama kiki Agama seska loaded Na skia wa utesa na G3 This is the ride of dying Heri kuliko kamiti Cause I would gladly take nine Like my name is 50 Strange It takes time But I'm already in it I'm on your face Like when FaceTime Hadn't been invented See what I intend Is a great time What we not pretending <laughs> Ati kuku? Ya yeah, kuku, pasta. Pasta, pasta? mzima man. Wapi? Tosta kijo man. I think ni hapa. Wapi? Tusha fika? Ni hapa. Eh, hii gete green. Alini shoni gete green. Kono siki ngoma? Nis. Ebu ngoja? Suski ye. Ngoja. Ah, sao. Wait. Eh, hey, think ni hapa. Ah, Sindio? Eh. Hey. Eh, hey, suski yongo me ina hanzo maze. Naisikia? Eh, hey, naisikia. Ngoja. Sao, sao. Chakusuwa chane mkol man. Woko rada kitu iwake, rigi m730 Wacha for me sakwe, wapi kuna party Ni wapi kuna totos wana chachisha vinasti Wame piga luku charges ni assault na battery Hawa jaji shuku wana juwa ni mapenting Love it when they move, the motions beyond interesting Hai akia mungu hawa shana sini kesi Na mini shashtakiwa ushahidi haiko pending I know that you witnessed all I'm saying last weekend Ya mahana wa Kenya wana kwanga tuwa sexy Sinanga uwezo I'm yours baby it sent me so would you Manda dance nigga penda if you'd let me Machali leo hamtalala Machali leo hamtalala Mina gang to kondan we to party steady sipping karada No si tense ni shaji pen if you see my gang moving karada Toki hop box kwanda is it put his steam na papara I go to know so it a bit it may go down Kachwara Niko auto angani but there any designated so Fast ni take pangani ni shikira iya baby bro Moto kama pasi easy steam zita wapanda chona Kawa na shukrani waeleze that we gotta go Mamanzi leo hamtalala Mamanzi leo hamtalala Looking at her Insta, seeing her self-control Cause I'm liking all the pictures I'm losing my soul, baby take it, take it I know you already know that you make me, make me Wanna give you my all, my addiction to beauty Cause God is a woman, so ni kichocha sana Baby don't judge me, I'm only human It's an affliction of music to show them you're divine Wanna die me down for them, I just say that you're fine But not before I tell them about the greatness of your mind And how you drive me crazy and I really love the ride Jana uliposka vida ukida tiwan Had a dream I caught it and when I did you smile Machali leo hamtalala Mamanzi leo hamtalala Maji ndo chesa cause hydro lazima Uki mix shot na yo sodo na tupima Ngale me colors badu bin kasita Na DJ ako sawa niko hapa tuko speaker Kila dakika kutwak ni lazima Hapa watoki kwa meza watazima Na kama uzitoki hautazungushiwa Kudance na ukuta haita kubaliwa Gang to condan watu pate steady sipping karada Si tense ni shaji pin If you see my gang moving karada Tuki hotbox kwa ndai Suti pote ze steam na papara Na iboti nusu itabidi Ime go down kachwara 
Niko auto angani badere ni designate so Fast ni take pangani ni shikira iya veve bro Moto kama pasi easy steam zita wapande jona Kawa na shukrani why is it that we gotta go Shika brother. Hey. Atumesema tunangoja nani? Ashi, yeye anaka ku drive, msi drive any moment. Unasikia? Wewe 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 wacha wacha. Wewe wewe wewe. Wacha. Ako wapi unajua mali yako? Anaka ama anaka ama anaka mtu wangu yako. Anaka msi ndole. Simoni. Ndole 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 ndole. Sasa tutafika kwa sanga kinzi. Ningebaki tu nyumbani. Ni aje asi, ni aje luki. Eh tukupo brother. Ukofiti tuende nini? Eh. Cheki, niamshe tukifika. So wash your radio. Ah uh, ah. Uh. Baby wangu sukari na hata nikiwa mbali naitaka kila mahali kila mahali kila mahali. Baby wangu sukari na hata nikiwa mbali naitaka kila mahali kila mahali. I know I'm not religious. But with you all I do is pray. I don't mean to sound ambitious. But what are you doing today? I want us to be official. I don't mind and really we wait. Let us start our own traditions, yeah. And I really hope that you on a spin a left hand on your thigh where we headed you don't really care you just told me the other day that you really lucky when i drive go masafi akuna traffic we just cruising at 80 and i mean that in miles i'm looking good you're looking better better than the sun and illa just a kumi walai mutual chicken dan ya keja kitu meja just kicking it with skin and why na mupenda kunda nyama wecho cha salad leo si chomi na cheza na fry movie seti ba fast to kiss it ndo manze zikishika itabidi zime nice you know I know movie had to my lazy when you started to kiss me I had to give you pipe Stay Where you think you're going stay Come on and bend and stay Where do you think you're going stay Till morning girl hold me Everybody know oh you want me I want you put it in a movie and let the thing show oh you and me you with me out of this planet in a new zone to go the anime radical no bahari conversation ni deep na bado ni lovey dovey my topic had is a beast till when i started to tease come on your evening breeze nika chacha tunge ndani eh never basic because we never base it on fake shit we just make shit fly like spaceships i know so i'm believers is crazy like ape shit but i to see wala umu when the bitch don't make shit i know and trying to judge none just trying to love one and see my life done Let the fire burn but never let it burn not cuz without you Ni kona visions of where na put in and safari za ndege ndo form ni shike mkono twende zile inchi ati mamore wa kulanga kisembe babora mimi niko nawe i always pull up in heaven girl Baby, one goes to Cardi. 
Eh, hey, gari ni aje? Eh, hey. dopi gari manza kustor hey. jo kushule kama gede. Mafuta mafuta hivi jo. Eh, hey. kwa ni aje tumefika? Bado sio pale wapi? Pale wapi gari mzima mzee. Ere shida alternate. Hosijui. <laughs> Sawa. Because the greatest thing is that life. See? It's life. Life for deal with. If the preacher read the Bible and tell you that you have to die to go to heaven, then it not, it's not reading the Bible. Because the Bible tells you you have to live in a heaven. You don't die and go to heaven. You have to live in heaven. Thank you for showing the way the sign that'll be my saving grace now na jaribu kuwa poa juu nikunja kila sana tete make na jaribu kujiponya move out the way move out the way i don't want a spirit i tell them more beer na mengi yako sema lakini hutasikia i'll play it by ear i'll play it by ear once cliff at it just the evil away Spirit, I tell you there's no fear I mean, I can say my lucky nigga does it care I'll play it by ear, I'll play it by ear Once before I did, it's just the evil away Smoking like a rizzle from the prisons of my Bible Smoking up my demons and they're watching for my night Don't believe in that I can, so I do it for the asshole I give you what I think you need as long as he don't make you bleed But only you can make you be everything you meant to be Middle for my enemies, another for their tendencies We ain't living in fear, I'm out to give the world the best of me Say it with your chest for me, my only crime is self-belief You'll never put a hex on me, mama's gonna stay true to me But he ain't still get through to me, this will be the death of me Maybe I'm just one of the crazies who believes in all deities or not Am I all that I got, who will save me again? When I'm stuck in the spot, I will make me make my way to the top. And if I fall while I am climbing, I gotta shoot for the drop. I don't want a spirit, I tell you there's no fear. Now, Mingy, I could say my lucky new that's the gear. I'll play it by ear, I'll play it by ear. Once before I did, just the evil away. I don't want a spirit, I tell you there's no fear. Now, Mingy, I could say my lucky new that's the gear. I'll play it by ear. I think to my fika. Eh wewe, swamkiba. Ah, tena. Tabia gani hizi? Eh? 
Kunye maji. Kunye waba kwa chini. Nachiki kuni wapi. Atana. 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 Look at the monster. Polaris Halo. I'll do it again. I'll do it again. Again and again and I'll do it again. I'll do it again. Again and again. To pata yo ganzi. To kata yo maji. Again and again. To piga yo janta man. To piga visaf. Again and again. The sun if you're mad. I'm not in a hurry. Again and again. The sorora ma manzi. Cause I only mada Again and again Garada ya five Oh ama utalala ndani pana Again and again Sikila sa eighteen Sa zingine kandani pana Again and again But fuck it I love it Na happy siyachi Again and again So na piga Versace Na zote ni mbosti Again and again Then I hala mamanzi Mamanzi wagana Again and again So na chocha mafisi I hope wakubali Again and again Juko mfuko na chwani Sabu haingi yani Again and again But brother haka hala Haka nisho nisijali Again and again And I'll do it again I'll do it again Again and again And I'll do it again I'll do it again Again and again And I'll do it again I'll do it again Again and again And I'll do it again I'll do it again Again and again, it's a building called Kazi Na hangover ki nasty Again and again Ime dunga virasmi Ba macho ni Chinese Again and again Na boss ni mtiaji It's like a linyonga monkey jan Again and again Wacha ni inge timeline Na sikia kame waka bana Again and again Ati yule kasisi Halibita na kuku Again and again Haiku hape na ivasha Ili hape na kuku Again and again Ati ndani ya mandizi Lidanganya na tu Again and again Ati nani ya limpato Alisema ni nguni Again and again History ni chocha You know they do anything for cloud Again and again And they'll do it again They'll do it again Again and again And I'll do it again I'll do it again Again and again Kwa wamekata mziki ya pandani Sujua watu watoki ya ma Mwono wanaje Wafanya kini Wase Nazo nisaidia kubebe uwe Mungisha hapa pandani Sijamaliza Sijamaliza I'm going nowhere fast And I'll get there on time all I can do is try, all I can do is try, all I can do is try Scary how deep I feel this I can bet everything on it It's easy to think it's easy Don't wanna be scared of it Makes all the difference already know that So na tema kandenga sometimes I hold back My time ucha chisha like I am all that But who said I wasn't I feel like I'm buzzing And out of ten every time I'll give a dozen And fuck all who doubting that I can be something But big on my fans Girl my cousin and all of who got me I'm still hugging in their design Ya kukodi si choki na rodi Lazima moskodi tu pige ka 40 a day I'm just a second away So hitting pinnacles I'm stringing away 
then I'll have something to say That's me visualizing the Grammys and shit I am just making my way While holding the leash on this life is a bitch A skanga you bong on the tricks But if they ain't working for me, I'ma lose it I'ma just put down the bitch Put a king down, how to do it for the kids Sing along now, how to do it for the biz I think you know now, I'm never living on my knees On my throne now, I'll become what I feared
Sakabaki ya kondichi juya haki ya takikani na umati ya kutoka Atabaki hindyo uri kwa mzazi tusinete za uzani Nime, nime, nime uwa Tuko shere na itaki ya si eh, Tuko shere na itaki ya si eh, Tuko shere, 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 eh,
are in the mix with Maru.
trying to sync up and link up schedules so we could have you on the we show. We didn't have DMs, you guys. We've been sliding those DMs for real, you guys. No. Because even as she told me, like, I don't know how long ago to holler at you guys. Yeah. Then Valerie told me. Then Valerie. Then Valerie. But so when we're like, yeah, we told Valerie, oh, we need to. And then yeah. I felt so guilty. Yes, like, damn, I can't, like, keep pushing this. So I had to make time. Um, on a public holiday. Can you tell us about your day so far? Like, how's your, how's you? Today's been an off day, I guess. As to, in terms of like you, today as a public holiday and then a regular day in your life, has there been any difference? What's your day been like today? It's just been like a coward day. Okay. It's just a bunch of rehearsals and that's it. Okay. Yeah, so. so I have rehearsals before I came out. And what are you rehearsing for? Rehearsing for? For so I'm in this program called Perform Music Incubator. Okay. And we have a showcase that's gonna be broadcast like later in the year. Okay. So they actually already have the previous cohorts. Guys, yeah, the other yes. cohort, the second one, Kina Wendy BK and um, Manny. Okay. Jirai? Yeah, the oh, wow. showcase is already on YouTube. So okay. We just had Jirai on the show. Yeah. The show is yeah. so amazing. Yeah, Jirai. Yeah. Shout out to Jirai. She's yeah. like. And then she has like the coolest sunnies. Yes. Her, her, her style her, is so dope. Her style is just amazing. So the 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 performance is actually on YouTube if like anyone wants to go and see what all that is about. So okay. that's what we have to do. So before we talk to you about you, um can you tell us in the world um what the performing incubator is? Because um we've had a couple of people on the show um who've talked about it, but like yeah. as well we have to understand that there's some people who are listening in right now who are not listening to those interviews. So um for someone who's listening, um we have people listening right now, what's the performing incubator and who's in the cohort this year and I guess what are they trying to do with that program? Oh, okay. So it's basically an artist development program where it's not just artists who get the you know the help that they need there's also like artist managers publicists event organizers mm. some producers and engineers so what they do is they give you 10 years worth of knowledge in like three months well, so it's okay. a what? marathon since it started <laughs> but the top thing it is it is it's kind of it's kind of, you know, it can get overwhelming, but but it's really, really dope, you know, like, there's nothing like it. They don't want, uh, MDQ, um, I think it's, a, it's her initiative, okay. and she didn't want I love her, people to, to just pity her stuff that she did. Yeah. She just wants. She wants to give us the knowledge, not that we can. She doesn't want you to make the same mistakes she did in the sense of not knowing. In the sense of not knowing, yeah, yeah. like, anataka, anataka to say do kwa, kwa kwa na yon platform ya kwenye la kwa do, kwenye la kwa ta the knowledge that's gonna make them even more do. Mm-hmm. And the good thing is that they bring guys in the industry to facilitate the classes for us. So we are getting the information literally straight from guys who've done it. So, like, yeah, so even artists, we have some writing sessions with, like, guys who, who, who are, like, popping right now, like, uh, we had a session with Viri, which was, uh, like, I stopped him. Amazing! Going down. <laughs> I stopped him going down, I was like, yo, I just love your song, the Beleza, in your, 
and that in Italian yes. epidemic that had happened. Your fans are yeah. the worst. And I could not believe it, you know. Mm -hmm. And you would not get that opportunity sitting there with him, uh -huh. him telling you, so, yeah. you know what, uh, don't be afraid to do this and that. So when you're writing, you do mm -hmm. this and this and this. As in, I got first hand information. Info. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And especially since I really want to, as in, I want to be pop. I feel like okay. it's more, it's more forgiving when it comes to experimentation. Okay. And it's interesting to see all these different perspectives yeah. with all these different artists who come in to help us, you know, with our stuff. And then, like, the producers go and have the sessions with Mr. Car and, yeah. and this and that. So it's it's really hands on, and and then the showcase now brings everything after two, together. It happens after three months. The showcase happens after three months. So yeah, but okay. we start practicing for like in twenty twenty. Okay. So even right now, when you say you're doing rehearsals, you're rehearsing for the showcase at the end of this program. Yeah. Wow. Okay. And, How do you feel and about right it? now, huh? How do you feel about it? How do you feel about the showcase? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Skin. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I don't know. Because I'm so excited because the band is so good. Mm -hmm. It's just so good. And I have not, well, I have performed live like a few weeks ago, mm -hmm. like a month ago. But before that, I hadn't performed. Okay. Yeah, the MVK show. That was wild. Oh, the so video. Cool. What the fuck? Time. Not not my first time performing oh, live, man. but my first crazy. time performing live in a long time. And then you see oh, the okay. you saw the reaction, right? Everyone was like, oh. Let me tell you, I keep looking back at those videos and like I cannot believe this happened. Uh -huh. Like this actually happened, right? When I was writing that song, I didn't think it would go past. I was that. gonna ask you that. I was like, when you decided to do like the cover yeah, to say what was gonna be, did you have any idea what's gonna be this big? No. What were you what did you think it was? I wanted to I mean the reason for putting that song online was to bring attention to our mixtape. Okay. So you had no idea it was going to be yeah, yeah. the rap mixtape that I made with my boy Luki. Yeah. And that was literally the purpose of me putting that song. You had there. no idea it was like, going to be like that. Yeah, but it's I just did that because I really couldn't tell it because the first time I had the beat, you know, like it's just it was, it was really dope. Yeah. And I knew immediately. I didn't mm -hmm. even finish listening. Mm -hmm. Just the uh, first few the chords, whatever I was thinking, mm -hmm. I understood. Mm -hmm. I'm going to write for this song. Okay. And then I was kind of hoping that thing would go by. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't know. You're you, hoping. You're not you're hoping. Hoping. But then I told myself that even if it doesn't, mm -hmm. at least one or two people are going to see. Or mix at it one or two. <laughs> okay. They're going to see or mix it and buy. Because... Mm -hmm. As in, I'm still, uh, I wasn't that known then. Mm -hmm. And I mean, even now, I'm still not that known. What you, girl? But you're so humble, I love that. <laughs> but yeah, that was the purpose. She, I think, had something in my head. But um, so, yeah, I it was the first time doing something like that. You know, when you. I, I, I told myself I want to be open. Okay. Mm -hmm. I want to be open to anything. Because mm -hmm. I realized. Some of my limitations is that I had this like linear perspective on like doing music, mm -hmm. but then I'm like, no, I just I just want to do anything. Okay. Now I just want to have fun, and that beat came now into my life now. And at the right time. Yeah, at the right time because if this was way before, I would not have even thought about doing a cover, doing writing for that beat. Yeah. Really, look like you have a question. What's your relationship with Konyaki? <laughs> what? She, what do you mean? For that, it's not a relationship with Kodiaki. For it? Yeah. Try, try this concoction. <laughs> so, right now it's kind of. It's rocky. Mm. It's rocky. <laughs> <laughs> I've set my eyes on Kodjin. <laughs> but, I don't know what it is about Kodiaki, man. As in. <laughs> me, as in, as you do, like, so me, you do me by quarter. As in, literally, I tell you, I'm too going. Anytime I'm referencing, or, anytime I'm referencing alcohol, the songs that I have so far, I'm usually talking about Wait, I had a question before we move on to this. When you released the song, was it a freestyle? No. Or had you written it that one? Really? Yeah. Okay. Because it sounds amazing. Okay. Okay. Um, 
it's difficult. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh. But it's such it's a beautiful song. I, I told myself. In, in a calm, in a calm. I told myself. Um, I don't know. You know, writing is not. Sometimes it comes in five minutes. Mm-hmm. Sometimes it takes years mm-hmm. for someone to like. Maybe, and I was so lucky. Yeah. That this one only took two weeks. Two weeks. Because it was the second version I was uh-huh. writing. I didn't uh-huh. like the first one. Mm-hmm. And I made like this. Why did you like the first one? I don't know. I just need to read. Okay. And. Right. When I don't feel something, I just you know, scrap it and start again. Okay. And you, what pushed you to like put it up there on Twitter now? I missed it. So oh, okay. So that was like you were trying yeah, <coughs> to do that. Because, because it was so beautiful. Yeah, so. Mm-hmm. And I was just, I think, washing clothes. <laughs> <laughs> and I remember, you know, just chilling. Mm-hmm. Not overthinking like I usually do. Mm-hmm. And then I was just standing and uh, I just listening to the beat over and over again, and then I was like, mm-hmm. and that and I thought that things just came to me. Mm-hmm. But the chorus came to me like afterwards. Mm-hmm. But that part came almost like the first verse and the second came almost. So we've talked about the song for a long time. May I have a simple question about the song? In Nairobi. Is it possible to find love at Nakutosha? Because why are people not Toshake? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What do you have yeah. a Toshake? <laughs> Take it. Muna Kikanga J experiences that. And I'm usually just describing Kenya Kenya in a field. Muna Jua. Just as it can go. Okay. So, like, I think, I think, I think, what one of them could highlight the bad stuff, sir? Okay. People rarely talk about the good stuff. You know, what? What one of them is a drama? It's only about relationship. Siski. Because. Yeah, drama. What one of them do? Treat him like a boy. What one of them do? But it's like by default, too. Yeah, and actually, I don't even realize most of my songs, which is not what I about. No. This is positive. Okay. okay. Yeah. And you said you want to make pop. And I think like right now the person who's making pop I would say would be clean up. The person who's making pop right now I would say would be Nikita Kering. Like Nikita Kering, yeah. her sound is really poppy and Kenyans are actually accepting a pop sound where it's like we've not yeah. been like an R and B pop as sound. As soldier, I think me pop. Okay. Um as in two and it will be popular because pop is popular. True, the yeah. pop sounds popular music. Yeah, so the commercial is popular in it just it just takes different forms, you know. Okay. Like depending on you know how much artistry is put into the song, how much so una, it's yeah. So would you say that you are an would you say that you're a full time musician? Like what do you do for a living? Pol- Polaris is a full time musician or do you do anything else? I'm a Polaris doing something else. Polaris. Like, like, what, are you a full is music everything? Right now, yes. Okay. Yeah. So since since last year it's been Talk about that. How's that been? Like, how, how do you make that commitment? Yeah, Especially yeah. like making a commitment in an industry where there is no structure. You don't know if you're gonna get paid. So it's like, how do you make that choice? And like, how's it been? Like, you deciding I'm going to be a musician full time. I don't. I don't want to work in a hotel anymore. Okay. So you were. So you went to school for like hotel management. Oh, how did that? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I guess. Okay. So we go. It, okay. It. It wasn't bad. I'm actually very grateful for that experience. But I just wanted to like kill myself every day. <laughs> as in, I, was, that, was it? Was as in, once I'm there working, I'm like, ah, you know, okay, ah, this is dope. I love this. Mm-hmm. Then the next morning, you're waking up. Oh you know, god, I just want to die. And the cycle just continues. And, yeah, and and even when I was working, Iman was asking me, why are you doing this? I mean, you have the voice. Yeah. Why are you doing this? And I was just like, yes. Why am I doing this? But it was, it was from a, I was telling you, music is very yeah, difficult, difficult, especially in Kenya. Yeah. And that's actually one of the reasons perform is mm-hmm. helping guys to like navigate, Could I ask to actually you find know? themselves enough to, to, to know how to 
How to be an artist? How to how to how to navigate the industry? Yes, yes, that's perfect. Could I ask? Um, Wait, before you go on, can we toast to your relationship with Konyagi? <laughs> 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 but you know what? It's not to go. It's Tanzanian, but we'll let you. We'll we'll let it slide for today. Yeah. Some kind of thing. I, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it's it's smooth. I think it's a smoothness, honestly. Wait, and you play like, yeah. that song. I was, like, like, um, I was talking to her in the studio. Club, <laughs> club, yes. Ooh. In this world of love, you woke up to me with your konyagi and give me a drink in this club. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Because we can't talk about all of the things I want to talk about without going back. Can we go back to f- figure right. out where did you mean? From the beginning, where were you born? Nairobi. Jama Hospital. Okay. <laughs> and so when you in terms of growing up I what, grew up in Maine. Okay. Like never yeah, this one. And in your do you have siblings or yeah, is it are you, I have how three. Okay. Um I'm the first one. You're the first one. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And when oh, you, tough. <laughs> has it been the has it has it's it been the older brother. sibling? And the only brother. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You're like the mother now. But well, you have to Kind of somehow, I don't know. Okay. Yeah. But then are you kind of you given a gift by God? When do you kind of figure I, as you're growing up, are you listening to music? Do you Very much. Okay. What kind of music and what kind of music is this that's being played? My folks just mm. you know, like a mixed bag. And you know, you don't realize when you're a kid that oh the you just surrounded by all this sound mm. and then you realize later that oh I like this band, I like this and that. As in I remember my one loves musicals, like like films mm-hmm. a lot. So like stuff like the song of music. Yes. Singing in the rain, seven brides for seven brothers, fiddle on the roof, like the classics too. Uh high society. This one's fucking um this case of Captain Fred Astaire and yes. Rogers and all that. And then they uh, my dad loved like a lot of Lingala and and Harry with the Fonte okay. and Abba. Oh my God! Abba. We literally used to have nights where it was just Abba playing the whole time, and that's because. That and are you guys understanding, or just like having a good time? We are having a good time. Like, and my dad just explaining, you know, that's this, this happened. You know. This, this happened, mm-hmm. and it was so dope. Cause now when I come now to watch, um, this is pop on Netflix, and they have this episode called Stockholm Syndrome. Mm-hmm. And I see them as like the biggest pop, whatever in the world. Mm-hmm. And then they mention how Abba changed it. Now I understand yeah. why I love pop. It's literally not by mistake, you know. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Um, Are you. So, as a, uh, sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. So, influenced by musicals, and then. Musicals, and, 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 and then my folks also sang in church. Oh, okay. With. Um, with their, like a group of friends they met in college and stuff, mm-hmm. and then now. Uh, See you, Christian. You know. <laughs> I guess Catholic, whatever. Catholic <laughs> too. Well, yeah, you yeah, no something. Fire. Something. 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 You know, you don't forget it. Do you hear that word? But yeah, young Catholic association. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So they sing. So my mom was in last hymns. Mm-hmm. Um, like it's a classical music mm. and stuff, and so that I was introduced to like different kinds of. So you music. grown up around music and you think you went to your journey completely. So you didn't just come out of nowhere. It didn't come out of nowhere. So your parents are listening to this kind of music. What what are you listening to? You I'm listening, listening to what they're listening. To. And are you singing? Because so, as a kid, are you singing? singing. So. Where did you start? You were like, what's your first recollection of singing? Are you singing your own song? Are you singing some like as a kid? Even if you're singing for for, 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 for aunties and stuff. Or choir. Um, what is my first? Song? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Class eight. Okay, tell us, tell Class us a story. Eight, I was in Riara. And okay. It was a prayer day. You know, and then we were divided into like pairs yeah, and stuff. Yeah, I know that. And then they told you know you have to practice this song because you're going to be singing for the parents. Yeah. So the pressure. Because I'm busy. But for some reason, <laughs> <laughs> but for some reason, I love that song. I even remember it back then. I don't even know. Like. Sing the song. I don't know, Missy. Uh, Missy, if you're anywhere out there, I still remember your song. Uh, how did it go? 
But she wrote it herself. It was her song. Okay. And she she taught it to us. And then we were told, ah, you know, all of us sing for people. So the girls partner it was like, yo, you know me, I don't know. Blah blah, please you just you just help me. Yeah. I was like, yeah, fine, whatever. So I got done. this. I got yeah. this. So it's done. And that's the first time I saw guys looking at me like, wow. You know, so you never, you never see. This, had you ever sang in front of people before that? Never had me sing. Before okay. That. They were just a chick, you just quiet, nothing. Were oh, you no, quiet? Were no. you quiet, or what were you like? Was, Besides the sing, I was like, a very awkward kid. Why would they choose you to sing? Yeah. Why? Like, why you? No, oh. I see you. Mm. Everyone was singing, so it was just my turn. Oh. Yeah. So everybody had to try. But uh. there's one part I overlooked in class six. The teacher gave me a lead. In a song for like praise leading day, so I was leading the whole class. Okay. But I never thought about it like that, you know. I just thought, ah, you know, this dude is just doing for someone. <laughs> now I realize, oh no. It wasn't a mistake. It's still coincident. Yeah. So they clapped for you, but they had. I was really shocked. You know, they never had me. They just knew me as this awkward kid, you know, trying to fit in and, and being really weird and shit. Okay, explain, explain yeah. being awkward and weird and shit. Like, what do you mean? What are you doing? You're doing the most. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing absolutely. I was just trying to make friends, but then I guess I wasn't even going about it the right way. You know? But who, but at that at that age you don't know. Who's, they don't fucking know. tell you, yeah. and you can't go to your parents yeah. and ask them because yeah. they don't understand. That's true. You're so scared of them. That's true. But they, you know, kids can also be very brutal. So yeah, quite. That that I agree contribute to your insecurity. Yeah. Later. But that's that's a, the loss leaving the loss because those kids don't know shit either. Mm. Well, I guess to each his own. Then I went to school. I was in Cubs, my girls, Nairobi. Okay, so you, you you do this class, same thing, you do really well. Finish. People. But then you don't want to talk about it okay. after that. Like, that was the start. Because after that, we were just all singing the song together. She just wanted to find out if we all know the song. Okay. That's why we were singing it, like, one by one. Oh, we won't do it. We won't do it. Just one yeah. you know, teacher. Yeah, yeah. And then this kid doesn't know. <laughs> but that's the first time. That's the, honestly the first time I remember the singing and, and guys being like, what the shit. I honestly thought it was just see. And then like But it's not like it's like that's that's what did for everybody. Oh yeah. Like, no. <laughs> everyone. What do you mean? What is the big deal? But like see, I was telling you earlier, not everyone can execute the plan you have. Yeah. They would execute the same way. But yeah, that was that was for me. Then then I went to high school and Where'd you go to high school? You don't know. Oh, okay, okay, smart smart. smart. <laughs> then um then what happened? Yeah, then I joined the choir. You joined the choir. Yeah. You, 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 like for one, for one. Like for one. Like for one. So at this time, not for one, for two. Okay. Uli choir. Si chipeleka. Well, yeah, but what's up on this kind of game? Where were they? Yeah. As we were just hanging out, in the back, we were just hanging out, and then I just like burst into song like spontaneously. Let me tell you. When I'm chilling and it just you can say a word. Experience and, 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 and like a song with that word will come to my head wow. and I just start singing. Okay. It. Okay. So it happened like that and then I was like, you should join the choir. I was like, okay, fine. And then I joined the choir and it was so amazing. Oh, it was so yeah. amazing because you know, it's singing. I will take it in whatever <laughs> form it comes. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, yeah, and then all through high school you guys were just telling me I was singing for me on my birthday. I want you to surprise someone. Mm. I want you to, I want to surprise someone and go sing for them. I didn't pay you for for They were not surprise. paying me shit. And <laughs> I really wish I was. But you were you singing? You love it. I love it. So I did so. Bitch, okay. better okay. have my money. You can any opportunity on that to sing like a bar. I mean, me, I'm just thinking. I was not even trying to throw a candle or you get a manchapo or you get like this <laughs> game. You just sing that to you. So singing for guys and stuff like that. And that was just basically high school. Although I remember something. Tell us. Let's see. Which I had overlooked. Like, you overlook too much. I think Polaris you overlook a lot of things. I know, you have bright talent, right? But the school anthem they have right now I actually wrote it. What? At a <laughs> for my girls. What? Mm-hmm. While you were in the choir or how did that happen? I was in the choir. 
Like when you okay, what's the school anthem? Two, 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 four, four, okay, you're leaving now, you're okay. Yeah. What's the school anthem for my girls? So let me ask you so something. That, that is actually the first song that I So wrote. you become a song. Okay. Not only can you sing, you can now write. Now then I became a songwriter. That's what I'm saying. That's what? you become a songwriter. Well, yeah. what came first? Singing or songwriting? Singing. singing. Yeah, because if I hadn't started singing, I wouldn't have written that song. Oh. Yeah. And so, then uh, from hearing different many different songs, I remember I actually remember the thought process. For making that song, like you know, I'm gonna remove this part and then I just put some words here. It's a bit so I was then. picking buzzwords, you know, mm. like strength. Yeah. You know, moving on together. Yeah. You know, hard work. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> so in this time that you're in high school, what subjects are you taking? Like you, okay, I, I I'm asking because what's your plan for after high school because you're in high school you're in the choir you're busting into song yeah but you i mean you're you're still in school so you're taking classes and you have grades and expectations i guess you're in high school what classes are you taking in high school and what's the plan for after high school for you and then you're famous because you're seeing everyone's but the wishes not famous famous maybe just in my Form, okay, know. okay. But you don't know that. Do they know? I don't think they know you wrote that. Answer. That's the form. That's the no, end. Maybe the guys in the form. But I think even now guys forgot. Because you know? okay, okay. it was just this thing. The teacher was like, yo, um, so we need an official anthem. Because the one that we had is just this one's for roasting people doing like sports games. Steam, steam, panda, panda. Mama, chocho. So we just need an official one. So what I did was I took the, 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 the first part of of the like hype song and just that put like I made it a song. Yeah. You you made it took yeah. it from a chant to a song. Yeah. You structured it. You said you remember how you structured it. Yeah. 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 So that time music was still being made. So I did music for KCC. Okay. And we had the practical which is supposed to like compose a traditional a traditional song and dance. Out of what nowhere. What we compose. Out of nowhere. Uh, I don't I... even know how do you even start or like what traditional so I did like this, in mother tongue or like any traditional in mother tongue out of nowhere bro. like well it could have been anything actually but I guess at that time the pressure is you're feeling like you know you have to do what I yeah so what I did I just took all the new traditional gospel songs that I knew and just put them together and then just That's asked nice. fans in drama <laughs> <laughs> you know how to let me dance <laughs> and that was it <laughs> okay and it really helped me like even my teacher during my exam my teacher was out there and I remember because I was just having fun singing that song, like, because I had to say some skirts, and yeah. this, and then my father was like on the drums, and then we were dancing. And then when I left, my teacher was like, wow. Like, that was, like, even guys were out there, like, yo, that I'm was visualizing amazing. it right now. Seems like an amazing song. You know, but in, in my head, was, it was just an exam, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. But then I knew I wanted to do, to do something with music. After high school, you knew? Yeah. 
And then you, talk, you, you knew this like when you public or you said in your head and in your heart or your parents knew Polaris at I Polina Taimba. What, oh, I guess like because I'm asking like okay you 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 know people want to okay, I want to be a lawyer I want to be a doctor. Oh Polaris at I've always wanted to do music. Wallahi. Ever since I started singing in choir in high school, uh-huh. I remember telling my dad I want to make a million dollars because Asha made a million dollars yeah. doing music. And then he's looking at me like what are you talking? Pumbuza banki. <laughs> 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 Because I remember watching a documentary. Yeah, one of the kids, like, like, at, now, yeah, like 13, 14, there, and I was like, Britney started seeing what she was wearing. And I was like, wow. Okay. And I even focused. So the, the stars in my yeah. eyes, like, they shut the down. The twinkles. Quickly. <laughs> so now you finish high school. How do you do in high school? How, like, I was a marriage. Okay. Kid. What's the plan? Okay. So, okay. I, I, I got a C, you know. Okay. But I got, I got an A in yeah. English. Because you can write, of course you got an A in English. <laughs> and then and I got like a B plus in music. I was like, okay. 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 I mean, I'm happy. I didn't even care about it. The rest. So at that point, because I honestly don't even remember what I got in anything else. Mm-hmm. But now you're thinking, okay, now you're done with high school. Where do you go now? Are these million dollar dreams still in your head, or, or, or yes, and, and you're, finished, you're, 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 you're you're young and now you're done with them? Now, Where to next? Yeah. So after high school, now one of my high school pals who we were singing with. We got together after high school and mm-hmm. she, she has a great voice. She was calling me and we went and recorded our first song together. Oh. It was the song. It was called Six Feet Under. And it was so dope. What do you mean was though? Can I ask? What do you mean she was called Madge? Now you're not anymore? No. Oh. After that she she just told me she can't do she just wants to go to school. So I mean I was I feel, you know, reality just checks you. Yeah. yeah. It's understandable. It's, yeah. You expectations, you parents, understand. pressure, yeah. everything. So I, I really couldn't blame. I just don't I understand yeah. and, and that's fine. But why okay, how comes you and Mel? Why why you and Mel together? Why, 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 I mean we were friends. Okay. It just it's I mean we just vibed. Mm. And we just found each other. So what did you in Mulpata Studio happy? Could you could you know finding no, Okay, so no, talk about no, I want to talk about the process of that. What year is that? And like she, how do you guys okay, why do you find a producer? How do you write the song? What the fuck is I'm going very on? Old, actually. <laughs> that was a very long time. Um, when is this? Yeah, when, okay, when are you done with high school and when are you doing this? It was in two seven. Okay. That you're done with high school? Yeah. Oh wow. I, mean, I, I told you. Oh wow. Time ago. Uh, it was a, she knew a guy from uh, who had a studio in Tao and opposite opposite is it um opposite or adjacent adjacent to I M Bank. Okay. And it's this building. What's the name of this building? But you know it. Yeah. But before you go to the studio, Cameo. I think so. It's, it's where Pronto, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's opposite. And it's like place. yeah. So okay. that's where we went. To okay. Record. But like okay, you guys write okay, you write okay before you go to the studio, you've written the whole song. Yeah. And but there's no beat. No. Only a cappella. So you've written, what's the song no, about? No, there's a piano. It was just about to go. Okay. The chorus was I gotta be under the water and I hope there's gonna be ice. I gotta be six feet under and I lose heart on the surface. Yeah. It's called gospel. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's just about you know. Strength hope. and hope. Strength. Uh, Not giving up. So you guys record the song. That was my first studio session moment, so okay. to speak, and I really liked it. But then I have to go to school now, so I went to Musongari College <laughs> mm. <Okay>. for IT. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect that. I didn't even know. You have a fan who says, Mom, yeah, I love her and I play her song with Prince KB every day. Ah, I love you too. <laughs> 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 uh, yeah, so um, Musongari IT College. I went to college, then for a couple of months I did that. Then, then I found, you know, then I went to this is hospitality school in Kitule called IHT. I know that school. Yeah. They teach you how to like, it's dope. When they have graduations, you can go in Kula and then you, <laughs> it's, a, it's a vibe. Only joking. <laughs> 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 Only joking. Only joking. But like, it's, it's, it's really cool. So you go there. Did you, okay, so does the IT thing work out or you just say, no, it's yeah, not I finished. Okay. And it actually really helped me. Okay. Um, even like when I went to do my other studies because I was pretty fast in typing and all that so I kind of looked essential okay essential yes and 
Yeah, so I went there for me a couple of years. I went to I had internships here in Jacaranda. Okay. I was working in the kitchen and I was working in Biani. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. But in this time, music is quite common. I'm still thinking about it. But between male, between male and nothing is happening. Just no. okay. Because after that, I didn't know what to do. Okay. Yeah, and I was alone. And I just didn't think I could go about it by myself. Okay. Yeah. So I went to, I was working in Biani and I remember seeing him. And this for the FNB, FNB manager. manager. He's like, why are you seeing other people's songs? What? Do you do? A fun place I would. As in, not a camera. Like, I, I get what you're saying. And, okay. Unachoma. But I've never forgotten what he said. I, I don't know how, I've just never forgotten that because of the FBI, you know. Yeah. And that's around the time I started listening to Capitol. And Sage had just chucked this. Hey! Yes, mm-hmm. yes. Because um, Sage was, Sage, Sage came up so different. Yeah. Her sound was so unique. Yes. And then her vocal range, she took it where niggas could never fucking yeah. take it. I was listening to that song. Oh, hey, shit. Capital, and I'm like, whoa. I want to write like that. I, I want to sound like that. And Fena also had, start, had, had started. Um, and Fena, when Fena started, her sound was very much yeah, it's singing. Because I remember I love this song of hers called Down. <laughs> She's like, I have been down, down, and I'm so, you don't know what to do. I love how when you're singing, you're so excited. Like that's blowing my mind. Yeah. I I love I your know, energy. I just love songs and stuff. Okay. <laughs> I love music. Ask me. So, so those. You're singing other people's songs, and the manager tells you where where Acha is or sing your own stuff. Mm-hmm. So yeah. So Nikaskia, Sasa is on the corner. Skiza on my. My day, well, that one particular day off of mine was on Sunday. Mm-hmm. And Kabul has this morning show. She yes. put down the chow dows now. Yes. With where they just that's it's an amazing. They play really soulful, and then they bring interviews, and, and they yeah, play Kenya. And then they have yes. this section called Bubbling Anchor. Yeah. Where they bring someone who's and coming, usually and Kenyan, Kenyan yes. and usually R and B almost. It's almost hundred percent. Yes. Kenyan, that section, yes. You know? And I think that's why I had the stage song. That's long time, long time ago. And I, I just, I was just, oh shit, like, wow, that sounds really amazing. Then my internship was over. Like, so, una, una, oh, oh, so, Diani, my Maliza, last more Rudy. Maliza, my Rudy, sasa, so, I'm like, oh, many months. Sun, my Rudy. Who can I Sorry, sorry, I, I, sorry, no. sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, sorry. I'm not trying to start I violence. Mean, was, it was not an experience though. You're in Diani, you're in a good time. You're in Diani, come on. I mean, yeah. warm weather, all through. When we were, we were, yeah. But it was like, you're young, it's an experience. I was, what? Like, we got it. Like, see, see, see. So, I would start going next to this bar called Tandori, and I think it's still there. Uh-huh. And you took out your night shift. Wait, badly. There's a day you need to even go to sleep. Like, I had a breakfast shift. So, Tandori. Choma, I can't see you. Choma. As a lala, I can't shift your breakfast. I can't wait to fuck it. Come on, we're going to match it to Zinafuna. We're going to do it in a sense. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Choma, I'm going to do it. Oh, my God. Hey, you're going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. But then, so, after that, um... Yo, I came. Today's episode is sponsored by Handa's Juice. Go get that. Yeah, that's Handa's. That's why that's hashtag. Shout out Brian. Just Shout out Brian Nairo. We love you, bro. He just dropped this for us right now. New packaging, by the way. So I love Handa's Juice. Yo, yo, no. Yes. I want my kids. I. But yo, so you're telling us about okay, you're in Diani Bashment. Kwanza na kumuka touch rugby kwenye kamuko. Oh shit, siku na juati yoni ni. Of course. So after that, we come. Then I found men. The same men from the first song. We put an Randomly, I'm Japanga. Okay. How many years? 
Wow. After that, she's like, bye, me. Uh, well, yeah, she just wanted to So she went to school, yeah. Yeah, she went to school, yeah. Uh-huh. No, and she, she also, okay. So I met her. And she told me about this program she was in called Saudi Academy. Hey! Ah, yeah, I, thought she, I thought she went to school. After, after she finished. Like, oh. She came. Because oh, okay. okay. Saudi Academy is super she, dope. Yeah, yeah. She finished and she joined Saudi. So she, she, she got signed to a label loads and now she was starting music also. Now. Okay. I want to trust them in myself. What's her name? Melbourne? No, no, no. Melbourne. Um, you put your name in the name. Yeah, because you have to click talk. Okay, sorry. I know, I know too many emails. I'm going to figure out which mail it is. Okay. So, um, um, then what happened? You meet Mel in Tower. She tells me about Saudi Academy. So I go do my research and stuff. Well, as much as I could at that time, mm-hmm. and I saw that they had auditions, she told me there were some auditions coming up. Uh-huh. She was going to take it out. So, mine was putting you on in her yeah. way. She, she did. She did. She did. She, you know, you're just from high school, and you don't know. Pressure in me. Yeah. No, not you appear like. She has not like me, like, or anything. Like, but not to go to discover. Okay. No, no, so I can't come to discover too. Okay. Mm-hmm. No, by a for me, me, I just wanted someone by my side like, all the time. She's going to go out like, better. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. On your own. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, like, shout out to her wherever she is right now. Actually, she, she has one of the best voices I ever had. Okay. Yeah. We'll check her out. So, so do, you go to, do, you, do you go to a Saudi Academy? Yeah. You do? Yeah, I went, I went and auditioned. Okay. And then I was going to go. Fuck off. <laughs> We've had people in this seat who went to such academy who can't sing like you. Yes. Wallah The thing, the thing. They said no. Why? The thing that 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 the only chance it was my confidence. I was nervous as hell. I went. I I I sat behind the door. What do you mean? I was so nervous to be in front of those people. You were like, like I'm just open that door in here that move, sing from there away. The minute they told me that, I just knew. I was not gonna get this. Okay. So they But you know sometimes God is interesting. When something doesn't work out, it's when, it, 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 it didn't it didn't work out for a reason. Well, so, so let me finish. Call this call 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 so I they, so I sit down for the feedback, they're like, yo, yeah, I mean, yeah, you have a nice voice, but unfortunately like I don't think you're ready because cause the program is kinda, you know, intense, blah blah. So maybe like another time. So I sat there and like, no. You said no. So said no. To like you, she talking? Yeah. What's like, jokes? Me, I've wanted a place like this, like where I can just sing for a long time. And uh, as in when they came here, I was sure. And you said no. I was gonna. So, yeah, I, so I told them, you know what, this, you have to give me like another option. As in, um, this is not gonna work for, for me. <laughs> 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 Thank you. I'd love to be a judge to be so, told no. <laughs> so you know they were kind of shocked yeah. also, you know. Because now you're shy, and then all of a sudden you're you're coming with with, with Fujo. I wasn't even coming with Fujo. I was just being honest. Like what 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 can I do? Where can I where else can I go and sing? Because I really just want to sing. Yeah. With people also. As in if you are home, there's only so much I can do by yeah. myself. So they were like, you know what? Okay, that's that's fine. So just wait for us outside to finish like the auditions, then we'll talk to you later. So I was like, yeah, sure. So I go out and then um I come back and she's like, uh, so we're gonna call this class and you're just you're gonna go there. So it's gonna be like for guys who who are not ready to join the academy, but this class can help you get ready to join the academy. So they formed like a whole class. <laughs> So it was me and some other three dudes called Nairobi, so I made up. Nairobi what? Nairobi. Like bees, bees. Nairobi. Nairobi. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And we were the first students in that class. And we thought it became so a thing. Of you. Of you. Yeah. Wow. It, it, it became part of the. the so what was the difference between that program and the actual so and, and, and the so actual? Because when it was starting, you know, it was starting with us. Mm. So there was no real, like, there was no, you know, strategy, but, I mean, so to speak. Yeah. It was just whatever comes, we just do. Although we had a facilitator to help us at least know, you know, let's do this today, let's do this, you know, and yes, just enjoy being. And are you doing this in conjunction with the work, or are you only doing no, this? No, that time I wasn't working. Okay. Yeah, I'd, I'd become a bit sick at that time, and mm. then. 
No, I was just doing this. Okay. That time when I just recovered a bit, yeah. So how's this? How's this? How's this? Like Saudi Academy? Academy. But it's not. It's not that. It's it's it's, it's you are within the campus and everything. But it's a different thing. How is this it's, for you? It's, a, it's like a different thing. Like yeah. Like from what they are from two or something. Yeah. But we are being in the same. I mean, I've been there because at that time, Saudi Academy was at Kenya and Kenya is like. Well, where sh- so was that? What's no, her, what's, what's, what's her name? I don't know. Ni- Hmm? Lady who started um Penny Um sh- Ninka. Yes, Ninka. Mm, but okay. it, it wasn't her who was Okay. It was a lady called Natalie. Okay. She was the one who was first in the academy. And Penny had had they were working like in conjunction with like so and the Q and just, just a band. Um and yeah. And and so you know me, I'm just there. You're sitting and then just seeing the walking part of like where yeah. you know, Were you swimming? So, <laughs> I was trying not to. Do you know, I'm just keeping my cool. There you go. But so, so I just became kind of. I just, I think that exposure to guys in the industry like that, mm. I just started feeling like, well, this is, you know, I'm like in the right place. Yeah. yeah. So then I remember, um, at, at the end of the program, of the, you know, that class was called Rotary. I was given a chance to sing by myself, even though Kelly that was supposed to sing together. Uh-huh. When, when, when did you oh. sing by yourself instead sort of gay collective? She liked how is that? She was like, yo, so for good. the concert, not for the guys in the academy, uh-huh. we were opening uh-huh. as a class, so we were singing oh. together. Oh. But then after we sing together, she was like, you have to sing when you are alone. You know the Beyonce industry is dead. No need, no care, you know, and the yeah. last time I just discovered Zahara, I from the same. Zahara. That's old, old. Like, okay. So, there's a song called Yo Yule. Yes. Oh, yes. I love that song. Do you know, I sang, concert, I remember how hectic it was singing that song. You, you know, wait, wait. So, I, before you sang this cover we had the other day, you had sung many covers. This was not your first rodeo at the high and this. Hampalaris. No, that was my first. But I'm saying, but before, but people don't. We see people here. People know you from this song that's okay. huge right now. But like before, you got to the point where you're auditioning on Twitter, and you had done so yes. many. People, you know, people think I, I started ten weeks ago. I'm here now. Is, Are you mad? This is like 2011. You think Prince came before that because that he, I, yeah. I and you don't just open Twitter and then you blow this up. This was in 2013, I think. I'm trying to stress mm. the importance of. The process. The people, process. Give, people, yes. people know you, you from this. People think you went on yeah. Twitter, you made a yes. video, yes. and now, Ati, are you mad? And that's, that's what. And that's why we. St- that, that's why we talk the story with people because it's fucking unfair of us to sit here and say, "Hi, this is Polaris. She has a song with Prince KB." That's it. And that's that's not your story. Yeah. People don't know that. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Like we have to talk about the shit. Yeah. So. Um, so yeah, I sang the lyrics. Oh. <sighs> oh, Lord, if I had it when the day fight and fly, but only when I hear it, you do that. Do you know you can, like, her voice and goes then, places, like, your voice can go really high. And then, and then, that time I remember, I was crying five minutes before going on stage. Because my guitarist was 20 minutes away, and we were five minutes to, <laughs> you know, I. I cannot go and say that I can't perform. You know, mm-hmm. like you just can't. I think it's very important for me to be reliable also. So my pal just saw me breaking down and he called his friend who was living just because we were performing in NJ Center. He just lives around here mm-hmm. and he would come with a guitar. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, yeah, this song has like three chords. So it's just this, 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 this. When guys were singing the, the anthem, the, the national anthem yeah. to open the name. Yeah. I wasn't, I was practicing. Your chords for your song, because you have no guitarist, you have a new guitarist who just yeah. showed up, you're trying to show him the chords to your song. To song. Five minutes to opening. Did he get it at least? He did, he's already booked okay. So, shout out to Greg. Yeah, uh, Greg, shout out to Greg. Shout out, big up Greg. So, um, so we go on stage, and I'm like, oh, and then, I wasn't even nervous, because I just cried, you know. I <laughs> I wait, wait, I want to get this over with. But does crying help with like butterflies? Well, I guess it does. Wait, so, where did you cry? 
Because my guitarist was not there. Oh, so you're like, oh, so you're like, oh, so 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 you're like, oh, 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 so you're no one is going wild so like how like, maybe they are just kids or whatever. Mess not like that might be finished. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's what it's called. That can't be right, you know. Uh-huh. I, 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 I don't know. Uh-huh. I mean I barely I felt like I just done it to get it over with. Yeah. But I guess I just also just did it. So, oh, oh, you did your best. Yeah, I'm gonna say like, why did you feel like, like you didn't deserve that after you just said it? Because, mm-hmm. like I've said, it's been a very long time. Mm-hmm. I thought anyone could just say mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. I didn't think it was anything special. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No one is going to execute the same way as in, it's not about this. It's taken me a very long time mm-hmm. to accept that wow, like, mm-hmm. you have to really do this. So you're a fucking genius. And when I'm saying a long time, yeah. I think it's this year. That's when you're realizing that. 2021. That's when I'm like, yo, I think you have to accept Since and you started in 2007, the whole journey right now. Like, mm-hmm. Now, as in, okay. even when guys are telling you, oh, you have a nice time, I'm like, um, you know, everyone does. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And it's, it's, not, it's not cool, actually, to mm-hmm. it, it diminish in your own. Yourself. But at least now I'm trying to get right. You know, just to accept myself and just not to be afraid mm-hmm. to like exact myself and stuff. No, I'm gonna tell you, you're a fucking superstar. I'm gonna give you your flowers when I'm looking at you straight to the stable while you're still here. You're a fucking superstar. When you blow up, thank you. Remember, you. Please you were screaming and like you're when so connected. You up, when you blow up, please remember it's... my words. Yeah. Okay. Yo. I'm here. I'm here. Thank you. <laughs> So after the South Korean Academy, so, what's so, no, that was just the rotation. So I get into South Korea. The real one. I didn't even have to audition. That was the best. So part. like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. She let's, like, let's, let's just let's just Yeah, that. She ready? So yeah. we go in, and then we have they usually have this um, end of term. Uh, you would like uh, sing? You sing a song, they record it, put it on YouTube. Bro, yeah, that's heavy. It is. Very Worms is on, I saw Worms on that. This, this, this will be cool if they post people on YouTube. If, if, if anything is going to teach you about how to take your first dislike, mm-hmm. it's gonna be that. YouTube. Because <laughs> I felt like that was the purpose for that, for that exercise. Okay. To learn that not everyone is going to like your shit. Mm. And I remember getting that first dislike. You guy. I wanted to die. You wanted to find out who are you what? and ask them, okay, what did I do? But then I got swiftly over it because I covered uh, as I had a song called Lisa. Mm-hmm. And boy, guys love that cover. Mm-hmm. And then she came for blankets and wine. I remember that. I remember yeah. that. I remember that. She came for blankets and wine. And then I remember the day after she had a conference. I said it after. No, not said it. There's a hotel somewhere here. Uh, one of the. Mayfields yeah, yeah. We crashed the conference. Yeah. <laughs> so I had like this small guitar that looks like a ukulele, but it's this kind of regular guitar. Yeah. And now my sister Natalie was there with me. And now, uh, by that time, I had joined Q. The, the band! I remember that! Ah, oh, fuck. I, remember, I forgot about that part of your story. Yeah, it's okay. Fuck. But now, now at that time, we had formed because we, we met now in South Academy. Okay. Yeah. So we were all there together, and now my sister is like, You have to put up your hand, you have to sing. And I'm looking at her like, No, I am not gonna do that. There's a press here. <laughs> yeah. There's literally like press. What to a gazette? Yeah. 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 Like, I said, like, How do I even do that? Where do you start, bro? So I just remember sitting there, and the kid was like, So, does anyone else have a question? <sighs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I just put it on. Yeah. I'm like, shit. And she's like, yeah, you. And I'm like, so, I am not from the press. I don't even have a question. I just want to sing for you. <laughs> and they're like, period. Okay, yeah. sing. Yeah. And the whole press just stands like, who are you? And I'm like, oh, shit. Then I sang that, that same song that I've done. The Disa one or the Fogger? 
Yours, I was like, I remember you from YouTube. Wallahi, she had seen the cover. She had seen the cover you did for her song. That's Why amazing. You, you actually asked me earlier, you know, my one or my dream collab. What is your dream collab? Who would you want to I feel like that would be. Now you have that. That's super now. possible, these though. That's yeah. super possible. If, right now, I feel like anything. Because I really have the second story. It's yeah. just being like a leg come Yeah, yeah. plus, mm-hmm. as in when I say that like, I'm really obsessed with her, her songwriting, mm-hmm. her songwriting actually sort of shaped somehow how I look at songwriting also. Mm-hmm. You know, because I remember the song Lengoma that she has. Yes, I love that song. Mm-hmm. I think it's actually, me discovering it then, I think it like had this weird domino effect for me writing on Okay. Oh, oh okay. yes. So I can shout out to yeah. her in a way. In a way, because okay. that was one of the first times that I was also discovering Afro House, even though uh-huh. I didn't know what it was. Yeah. Uh-huh. Even though I wasn't even listening to any other Afro House. And it's even interesting that you were covering her music instead of anybody else's yeah. music. Because like yeah. I've seen so I've seen the academy, I've seen people covering Bob Mali, but you chose to cover that. You know, that was yeah. you gravitated to that sound. Yeah, someone's this because the other time I was listening to this, what's the name of? I forgot the her name. And a South African lady, I forgot her name. But then you know shuffle. Uh-huh. Then Zahana comes and like, yeah, sounds really good. So that's how I discovered the stuff. So yeah. Let's stop for a second. In South Africa, you meet the co the co members of Q. How does that happen? Because we can't skip over that. Because Q was amazing, and the, yeah. I seen the the credits you wrote for them a lot, like. So like, how did that happen? Like, um, well, it was one of the girls called Tracy. Mm-hmm. She had her class. We used to have individual classes with the teacher. So our classes used to go at So when she's inside, that's where they're just waiting to go in. Mm-hmm. So the teacher was like, yo, a little girl is coming up. No, it was her class. Mm-hmm. And she was like, just sing this song. And then we sounded good together. And she was like, yo, you guys should consider this being a group. You know? mm-hmm. So after that, we... They were like, yeah, I mean, I'm down. How was it? Like, how? Yeah. how did you get, okay, she said you need to consider being a group. So all of you ever had that. So how do you, like, come to that, come to that? How do you get to that point? Where, okay, yeah, someone else shed some light or put something to me. We sang together. Okay. After that. Okay. And we were like, yeah, we sound good. And we're friends. Mm. This is not a bad idea. Mm-hmm. You know? Okay. So, it so, be so plus, high. yeah, plus we, that's a direction we've just been given. That seems like it could work, especially mm. now. This sounds really good to do. And for you, who's maybe a bit more shy and trying to figure out, like, it's being in a group Yeah, and, 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 and I know perfect. that, but yeah. For me, because you see, like, I said, I didn't know how to be alone. Yeah, that you said perfect. that. As in, it was, it was dope. So, yeah, we, sang, yeah, we started writing, started meeting up and just writing songs and doing stuff like that. And then, um, we. We did blankets mm-hmm. and ah, it was nice. And then um, after that, we got signed. You got signed? By, yeah. As, by, as the, got, yeah, okay. by MIS. Mojaz and Doho. Yeah, and Doho. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then that's when we did this dope cover of Aye by the video. And it's just uh, one of the yes. songs that we did. Okay. Yeah. So when you, you when you, was at the time when Tim's office was on the left that and then Jazz exactly. and I did we recorded an EP with Mombi in that studio with Jazz and like Tim Mombi Mombi K and like Yeah? Yeah. We did a whole EP. Wow. But like on the left was Tim Innovator and yeah. then Jazz and Doha. It was about the was time that, when that, was recording. Yes. Time. With yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Cause now you're working with Tim and Fees so that's a no, crazy story. Me, Cause I know, I know you. Yes. As in, it's just. I feel like when. Anyway, well, let me just. Let's continue with the story. Don't want to take too much time. Okay. So. No, um, we can be here until we're done. <laughs> um. You're in a group. So, yeah, you get signed. We sing for like about five years. We're together, just you know, doing live gigs, um, recording here and there, and then just putting out music, and then around. At this time, actually, in South Academy is where I also met my boy Luki. Okay. Yeah. So Luki was in the South Academy. He was not in Saudi, but okay. his friend was my friend was called CM. Okay. He was in Saudi. So it is South Academy has mob ties, you guys. Super mob ties. Super. <laughs> <laughs> you know even I can have been born in Saudi. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Like the first 
students. Natalie and Wawesh did a lot. Wawesh, like those guys, setting that, I, I've talked to Wawesh about setting that thing up. It was crazy. I mean, it, it's changed been, lives. Like, we have Hat the Band, we have Sauti Soul, we have MDQ, we have so many people because it's, it's the same thing as like perf- you see, the perform. Like, yeah. So mother was the. I mean, you can't take that away yeah. from, from that, you know. So, uh, yeah. You're so in a group. Was, you're making yeah, music. You're going. You're going. And stuff. And then in in 2017, now our friend Sierra died. Is this who? Is this Luke? No, no. Is yeah. Luke? This is Luke. Because now, when I, you know how I hear about you? I hear about you from a Surviving Nairobi episode where they interview uh, Little Pantheon. Yes. And then I heard an episode with Nene where Nene talks about the project he did and it features, like, it has Nuke's interlude, it has um, Thayu Moas. So now, even you're on a record, there's a record we played today that you're on off that scene. But like, Nukes yes, yes. Yeah. but like, Nuke dies and you guys are. I was devastated, man. Like, I think even now I'm still just, you know, getting, dealing with it. You know, okay. it's, it's, it came out of nowhere. And, and Loki, you know, I think we just, we didn't know what to do. We even lost touch at some point. Mm-hmm. There, actually, we even lost touch in them. Okay. And I couldn't go on. You know, um, depression just started seeing. Because you've tried, you've also, as much as we've also even been doing music and stuff, you just yeah. feel like it's not even going at the pace that you want it to go. Yeah. Yeah. You're still really trying and really trying, and you don't want to try anymore, you just want to quit, you know. Mm-hmm. And I, I guess this is what I did. Because you quit? I can't continue. Okay. I, I, as in, I don't think this music, um, I don't think it likes me back. <laughs> plus, I've looked at. It, as in when when he died, like, I asked myself, like he did, he had done so much, you know, for himself. I started asking myself, like if I died right now, mm-hmm. what will I have left behind? Yeah. You know, and it, that that's just like this gut punch, you know, this big gut. That's a very valid question to ask. So, I I just I just couldn't go on. Mm-hmm. You know, like, as in the the all those things you now like. This is you know, this on on it's so heavy, and it, it, you could see it on my face, like it was just a bad time. Mm-hmm. And by the end of twenty seventeen, I was like, "Fuck it, I'll just go back to school." So now you've already gone to school for IT. So you've gone to you've gone to school to do the other thing you did at I. So here I got a diploma yeah. in IHTI. Okay. So I was like, I don't have a degree. Why not just go for a degree? Okay. And this twenty and end of end of twenty seventeen yeah, into to early so into twenty eighteen. So, yeah, so I told the girls that you know what I think let's just take a break and then let's see what happens. Mm-hmm. And I was like, yeah, it's, it's cool, you know. Whatever you need. We understand. Yeah. Okay. So after that, I was like, yeah, I'm gonna go back to school for a year. Where you do you know where you just you're thinking? I didn't know where okay. At that time, but then so I went to Boma. Boma. Boma Hotel in yeah. They have a school there. Yeah. And I'm like, yo, so, yeah, I want to get my degree. And they're like, yeah, that's nice. But you know what would be better? Yeah. If you went to sleep at night. Oh, at the what? They are selling it. At the what? <laughs> so I tell my folks, yo, so there's this option that I've been given. I don't, I don't know what to do with it. And my dad is like, no more time for hobbies. <laughs> Man, <laughs> kill me. You know, this thing you've been trying to do for like now seven years. Yeah, yeah. Now. Like it's a hobby. No more time for hobbies. Ah, that thing killed me. Man. That's like that like, touch. That was, as in that put that nail in that I'm okay. never doing this again of course. And I was sure I was not going to come back and do music. When, when did you come back? She didn't go. I went. You no, what? You went to... I live on that day again. I didn't know what I was twenty eighteen. No more time for hobbies, you went. Hey. I was looking for I could not stay here. You know. You were looking for what I have I done for myself. myself. You know when you're feeling that badly about everything. Uh-huh. You don't even want to be seen by people. You don't want to talk to people. Yeah. You don't want to to even get hung out. Yes. You don't want I, know what you mean. I wanted to 
if the, that was an option, I was uh-huh. going to take it. Uh-huh. I wanted to. In a whole other continent. But I just want to tell you, unless you just work on stuff, uh-huh. however far you go, uh-huh. that shit is still going to remain with you. That is so true. You can't know from your problems. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I, I call it. To, to, yeah. you know, to just reconcile. But then the school work began to be busy. And then I, I got it was it was dope. I mean, you're in Switzerland, my nigga. Mm-hmm. Okay. I was, in, I was in a canton, the canton of Lucerne. I was in a school called HDMI, and it was it was nice. It was crazy, but it was nice. It was a lot of work. Okay. It was nice. I do not like the winter at all. You didn't go skiing but and shit. Yeah. So like 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 school, now is nothing. Our school was like kind of like at the foot of the Alps. So okay. you see, there's to come and You have to go skiing if you go to Switzerland. So there's to just make the trips to come and, and ski. So you'll be seeing them skiing in mm-hmm. class. So like how you manage your traffic to as in English are you know me at two years. How long were you there for? I was there for two years. Wow. Yeah. So I got I got to work in many really good places. Mm-hmm. That's that's one of them. Things that next I was yeah. as in I work I worked in this village called Stad and then you just you know, you see that mountain right there. You're like yeah, pretty bunny at least don't own it. It's just one of those like rich people villages. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, do you know culture shock? Badly. <laughs> I was usually the second number of the family. Because you have shambles, you get it because they have mountains. Yeah, they have mountains. <laughs> it's like a proper village when they're moving the cows to go to eat where. Mm. It's a whole ceremony. The cows are being valued, she had flowers already. What? And, then and here cows are just moving streets. Really? <laughs> like it's nothing. Yeah. I, just, I remember sometimes I was just walking and then Justin Timberlake was just standing. Fuck off. Whoa! Like, Justin Timberlake. Oh. I was like, do I go? And just like standing, just like oh, and just like sitting in front of him, like yeah. So that's actually where now. Hey, madam, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Imagine you want that place. They don't care about like that stuff. Who are you? Mm. No, because. Because um, everyone there is that thing, so yeah. it's nothing extraordinary about it. As in, man, wow, that was really nice. So that, but. In this context of what we're talking about, there's no music happening. No. You're just in Switzerland. I'm just singing. Hustling, collecting. You're, you're just singing in the shower, nothing. Are you even ready? As in, you, you, you left the group, you forgot, you, you forgot Kenya, you left the group. Aurudi, how do I call Rudy? But actually, no, the first year, I got kid of a psych back and mm. I came back. Because you come from a dark place. I came back for Christmas okay. and then I recorded two songs. I was here for like three Alone. Months. Just you. Yeah, I mm, that time I was calling myself for Wendell, of course. It's my middle name. Because you named Pauline Wendell. Yeah. And those songs are on the internet. Wow. Uh-huh. Well, well, so well, I found them. So I Yes. That, that, um, that I had written when I was still with Q. I was like, I want to get this out of the You know, people give you a lot of props for being a songwriter because of what you wrote for Q. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't, I saw it on the internet, someone was talking yeah. about like how Q, in terms of Q, your contribution. But some people think I wrote Monake, but I didn't write Monake. Rosa wrote Monake, the, that song that we put out, um, that it was our first song. Okay. We did a video in our record shop. Yeah. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. But guys usually think I wrote that song, but I, I, I didn't. Okay. I just want to hear that song. <laughs> but she's also a very good songwriter. Yeah. So, what did I say? Yeah, I came back and did those two songs. That was the first time now I'm doing it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Then I went back to school. Mm-hmm. Then I learned so, you're not really working, you're in school in Switzerland? No, I was in school and then I was working. You have to work. You're doing both? You, you, you do six months of school and then six months of working. And then you get a degree after? Yeah. And then it's a dig- like a bachelor's? Yeah. Okay. That's so. That's so dope. I have a bachelor's. That's, that's so dope. Thank you. Like, and I'm, you're so calm and contented. Shout out to you. Shout out to you. Shout out to me? Yeah. 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 I was living a lot but yeah, I have yeah, actually I have a bachelor's. That's dope. Like that's not a small team. Diploma, actually, in diploma, actually, in the diploma in 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 managing for managers. Okay. 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 I just felt, you know, 
I think it, I was I also just reading now. Like, okay. I need to do it at it because it was something to do. Mm. Yeah. So now when I went to work now in that mini that village, mm. that hotel was an initial mission star. It had a mission star restaurant. That's crazy. And you experienced that? Yeah. But then there I was a waiter. Mm-hmm. Which is a whole lot. But life. still, you're meeting people first and yes. yeah. But it was really challenging because, uh-huh. you know, those people don't speak that English. Wow. Oh, you know? Is it French or is it English? French. That particular place was in the French part of, of Switzerland. Yeah. It, was, it was near Geneva. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But no, guys were multilingual. Like, if that guy doesn't know French, he knows Portuguese. If he doesn't know Portuguese, he knows Italian. But, but if he doesn't know Italian, he knows German. But not Swiss English. German. So how are you learn some basics? You just have to learn some basics. So can you speak? Okay. No, no. Can you drop a master? Mm-hmm. Come mm-hmm. on. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm
Yeah, so this this actually a sort called controller where he sings and yeah. I kind of rap sing. Oh, so you're yeah. like, okay, rap singing. Because I'm trying to rap, <laughs> now I'm transitioning for the body and rap singing. You try to go the drink, the drink. Yeah, kind of way. Kind of way. <laughs> yeah, so until Nene yes. told us about this, he told me, I want you to do a song called Mixed Interlude. I mean, you guys, you guys were his friends. I don't think there's anyone else who can do this. Yeah. And I was like, yeah. And then I was like, can I ask Luki? Mm-hmm. I was like, yeah. So writing that song is what made me fun here. We hadn't, we were not LP yet. It came because of you guys recording that? It came because we recorded that song. Okay. Because we loved writing together that much. You know? Yeah. So after that, it was like, you send us no beats that you have. Mm-hmm. And he just started sending me. And I remember one time, with Hannah's two squads and let me just shut up. Shut up, Hannah's. It was um, the main ingredient yeah. in this particular session. Yeah. We wrote three songs in one afternoon. Whoa. Whoa. We wrote more, we now mixed it. We wrote Obvious, Mobia, and hey, guys, Scenario. We were still in the studio. Yeah. 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 We, were, we, know, we, were, yeah. we were in this place, but this place, okay. and then they have the, like this uh, chicken, the place where they keep chicken. Yeah. So usually go there when you know. By the Moji farm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we go there and stand there and just start like rapping and singing. Oh, so they're for the chicken now? No, they're going to spy it by the time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, you know, when you, you know, light up, you know, that incense and whatever. Mm-hmm. The whole smell for the chicken was like, no, so it's up for okay. the smell. So, I'm not still mm. So, or Luki come to ski, he starts to get on. But, I was what? Chicken? I was like, <laughs> Um, <laughs> that whole process of writing and this thing was amazing. And then it was dope because well, we also gave ourselves freedom to be individual artists as well. And he's actually the one who gave me the name Polaris. Mm-hmm. Oh, I was gonna ask that why Wait, Pauline is, and Polaris. Is Polaris the yeah. camera, the, the camera? No. The, That's Polaroid, Polaroid. 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 Oh, Polaroid. 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 Okay, so what's, what does Polaris mean? Okay, so he actually gave me that name because the name of my little daughter. Oh, oh the X Men kind of thing? What? And I was like, ah, if it's a full name, why not? Okay. But like, why? why? But then, uh-huh. no, he's like, um, he's like, a mother, oh, mother shit. Okay. Don't get him started. Okay. Mm-hmm. So I was like, yeah, I mean, that, that's dope. I, I don't mind. Did you know what, 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 who, 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 Oh, like the actual North is called Polaris. Polaris. Uh, that's so like you are a star. You are a star. <laughs> yeah. okay. That worked itself out. So, but I was told to be the only telling that story for for the North Star. Not for the Magic Joe. Then, then after that, there's a there's a house producer called Bobby Sakwa. Yes. He or he asked on on. IG, he was looking for vocalists. Mm-hmm. And I remember him from Oak Studio, he was doing a song with Karma and Kitana. Yes. Mm-hmm. That's where I knew him from. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I was like, shit, let me just send him a song. I had done this Karma kind of Sweet Love. In the one who's with Love or Sweet Love? Actually, yeah. when I was in South, he was called by The Nest. Oh my god! I, like, I love oh. The Nest. I love The yeah, Nest. That like, s- sweet and s- like, I love Sweet and Sour and I love Blue Ticks and Kisses. Yeah. But I don't know the one where he is called Legacy. Like, we're all coming. I still have legacy. Yeah. I have it. So I have sweet love and I love that song. Oh my god. I sent it to Bulisak and was like, yo, let's work together. And he sent me a beat and that was the second, I think it was like the second house song I think I was writing. Mm-hmm. The first one was Nisha Kapofika, the one. Yes, I have yeah, we played that. I did it with uh uh called Moira, shout out to Moira. Um and it was the most difficult thing I'd ever done. I was like, I'm going to fail this particular assignment and I don't know what to do. But then I actually really liked it and he's just put it, he's putting it on his album. It's coming out, I think, in August. Okay. Yeah, so I guess there's also that song to look forward to. 
Okay. And then, yeah, after that, it was just trying to figure myself out, writing, writing, and then they solved it in different way. Okay, so. Um, is Pauline and Polaris different? Is it like an outer ego? I'm a I feel like it is, because like, yeah. I speak with them now. Uh -huh. Yeah, we're going to Pauline, what are you talking about? But then, I get, I get, I get all those are evil things. Uh -huh. When I get on stage, mm -hmm. I, 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 I you get on stage, Pauline, mm -hmm. I feel like, Pauline is very, very, Pauline is like a, you know, I don't, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so that's why it was really difficult for me yeah. doing solo stuff, because yeah. you see, when, when I came back, yeah. Actually, the argument is that there's no Pauline alone song in the sense of like as as people are getting this. You see, people don't know the story about you. They most people would know you from either the. They know me from something. Yes, mm -hmm. but no one knows. Okay, who's it? And 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 that's why I guess the thirst for people. We want to. We do. We've had tastes and teasers of you. Now, where who is this person? Is, is where we're stuck at, and that's why we want to sit down with you because it's like yo, there's no project. We we can't attach you to a sound. We can't attach you to a part. It's it's pressure. weird. Pressure, you fucked up. Because now we, we we expect something really. Ha you can't give us garbage. I'm, 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 I'm actually working on a project. Can you tell us more about that, please? Tap a bit of Okay. <laughs> So but I'm so much pressure because if you like guys know me from Omenitosha, you can't expect maybe the same, right? No, you can't. No, music is diverse, so change the narrative. Okay. Um, okay, let me sing something from the project. So this one is called I Like It. Have you written it already? Not yet a release. When do you plan to release it? So you have on the two five four express. You had it here first. But okay, the, but okay, this is okay. So this project you're talking about, are we gonna get it this year? Yeah. Ah, who's 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 producing? Uh, this different. How many? Are, are we gonna get Tim on the? Is Tim producing? Yeah. Who? Uh, uh, at least one song. Uh, at least one. Or two songs. Okay. I don't know. It's not done. And I don't know what I'm saying. I think I'm EP. I'm an album. Okay. I love EP. It's a handy. Okay. I am just... Oh. Can you tell us one feature? You had it here first. Can you tell us one feature on it? Features. Well, definitely Luke is going to be there. Ooh. Nice. That was so nice. Well, the song I want to sing, actually, um, my own day actually agreed to... Yes, and my own has been putting in work from time. time. From oh. time, people, my, my, people think my own just came juicy, juicy. Like no, there's a song from her. Like so Yeah. Even before <laughs> she, that. She really, she, she's really, really amazing. So I can't wait for this one to be done. But I was just seeing my boss and the chorus. Okay. okay. It's kind of a bad life. Forgive us. Shout out to Handel Juice. <laughs> shout out to Handel Juice, hashtag Handel's Wonders. <laughs> Wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't know about that one. Yeah. May I say shout out to Polaris? Yeah. Handel's Wonders. I think so. It's like you didn't care, like, they recorded three songs in a whole afternoon. Come on. I heard. <laughs> 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 you just came up with that number. No, oh. it's their thing. Handel's Wonders. Shout out to Polaris. <laughs> <laughs> Kwa kona tukipatana 
That's amazing. Um, that's amazing. So amazing. I want to ask you um, my final question of the night before we close the show. Um, there's Pauline and then there's Polaris. But I want to combine both of them with this particular question. When it's all said and done, what would you like to be remembered for? When like, life has its own, it cuts cut short, or not cut short, it has its own ending. What would you like to be remembered for? Um, honestly, I just want to make a significant contribution mm-hmm. to like the pop scene in the Kenya industry. Mm-hmm. If not, like global, or wow. just here. Mm-hmm. I feel like I also came back to do music here purposely because mm-hmm. it's home, you know, mm-hmm. and it would be much easier starting again from here mm-hmm. with with support that you know. Mm-hmm. I have mm-hmm. and out there mm-hmm. where I don't know anyone and yeah, it would be yeah, I just wanna make a significant contribution. Mm-hmm. That's it. Okay. Yeah. I, I, I want to have done something that sort of altered some direction mm-hmm. in the way things are perceived mm-hmm. music wise. Yeah. So um I'm really grateful that we had the opportunity to sit down with you because um, you have a really interesting journey and I think that too many people are going to hear about you from one song and they will not get the chance to actually hear your story and that's why this is important. As much as we play music all day, I really believe that it's important that we get to sit down with these artists and ask them about their journeys because even I didn't know about your journey, I would be here saying, and then I'm like, that's it, you know, like, there's so much to, there's so much more about you. Yeah. And we've just learned about you. So there's so much more we're going to learn about you. And I'm excited for the future. I see you at Coachella. I see you, I see you fucking knocking out Afro Punk. So Alliance Arena. Like, I see you, I see you taking it there. And I really believe you can, because there's something unique it's about so, you. As in, I only performed one song at TVK. And you saw the reaction. Like I see you, you know, you know how I see like black coffee videos in Greece and shit. I see you and doing that, that same that? shit oh. and even a bigger reaction, honestly, because it's possible. Mm, I just, you know, there's also there's also like pressure of like the follow up, you know. What and the, and that's why I say you're fucked, cause you you came you came too hard the first time. Yo, but you know you went, you go hard and you go home, man. You just go hard and go home. But it's like this guy from Abba said in that um, series when they were starting out. Because guys didn't even like them in their own home. Mm-hmm. Someone else outside had to like them first. Yeah. We, actually, most Kens would not fuck with you if Prince KB hadn't come, hadn't you seen know. you. You know, like, I guess that's so fucked up. I know Little Pantheon, but how many people know Little Pantheon? Right. Like, in the sense of, like, hadn't I had a view from Sabah Nairobi over a year ago? Yeah. I, you see, most people are going to hear about you about this one song. And yeah. it's, it, it's, it's, okay. it's, it's, it's good and bad, but, yeah. you know. Because you know, but like you could be here for 20 years and you'd still be called an upcoming artist mm. with media. Of course. There's nothing. That's why you see the Grammys nominate someone for upcoming artists, you're like, that's not fair. But 
the, at least they are, they're noticing you kind yeah. of thing. But like, I guess for you, where do you want to take this? That's my, I want to ask you the, my final question. Maya is here for the first time. I wanted to close the show, but okay. I want to know from you, where do you want to take this? I'm saying I see Coachella. I'm seeing, I'm seeing you knocking out albums. I'm seeing you at the Grammys. I'm seeing you taking it everywhere. But like, where do you want to take it? Oh, if it's up to you, I like what's your, I want your dreams that are so scary to say them out loud. Where do you want to take this? Where do you want to take this? Say it with chest. I say my dreams of the Grammys, even though you know, of course I'm criticizing the, the politics it has. But you think they got a nomination? Like, you know, hell no. I'd take it like so much. I want to do so many things. I want, can you can you say some scary shit that you want to about, do? I've dreamt about singing at SNL. Okay. You know, yes. I've yes. dreamt about singing the. The James Bond soundtrack. Okay. Oh, okay. I know, right? Crazy. I know. Ah! I've dreamt about um, just performing like in a huge stadium. Okay. I've dreamt about collaborating with freaking Cardinalis. We. Oh! Oh, oh my God. From your house to Zambia. With Bruno Mars Sahara. Being in a Beyonce project because I feel like. Everything, do you know, like the way you're saying, um, the people I've met throughout my journey, even when I was with Ab, yeah, I have met them again now. Full circle, and now it's in a different capacity, yeah. And now, MDQ was on, let you answer the question. MDQ is performing, you beta, my nigga. Imagine, her and her fellow, like, facilitator yeah. journey, and it's crazy, you know, like when the universe just decides, man, and you put in the airport. Stuff and you just believe in that, in, in as in you just believe, and you're like, you know what, I can do this. I think the universe just listens and, like, yo, yeah, let, let me do this for you, you know, and when I just chill and let things go with the flow. Mm-hmm. Do you know this song has just escalated by itself? Yeah, I have not done shit. And Every time like, something happens to it, it is something. Different. You know many guys who are like, I'm gonna do this album, and then the album drops and not on the album. You, you know, like you could have, you could, you could have said, I'm gonna do this, and not even, you know, like, Prince Gibby can do what the fuck he wants to do. Me, I used to love fetch your life. So when this nigga said he's gonna put, you, if he didn't put an album, still he could have been fine. He didn't need I to. I only wanted that beat. You know, I only wanted that beat. I didn't even think of okay, okay. officially recording it. Mm-hmm. Okay, I did, but I thought maybe he'd give me the beat and then I just officially record it and then we did That's it. Yeah. Okay. But I guess he just liked it a lot. And it's mm-hmm. like, yo, let's put this on the album. I keep getting DMs from guys in NSA and Botswana. They're like, ah! And they're just trying to sing the Swahili part. Like, uh-huh. ask me what are the lyrics and <laughs> them. And just have to keep singing. And I'm like, oh shit, like, we need a video for this song. Like, now. Yes. Now. Because I think I would take it to me. Can we do that place? Um, <laughs> sure. Okay. Sure. Well, so, Pol- Polaris, I want to shut down by saying, um, my dad used to say, Martin Luther King had a dream, not a plan. So, and the thing about a dream is, your dreams can be put on hold and you come back and revisit. Like, Martin Luther King didn't get to live long enough to see what he was dreaming of. But, like, I pray that your dreams come true in the sense of, I pray to see you on SNL. I pray to see you on stages with Zahara. I pray to see you, like, doing songs with Bruno Mars. I pray, I, I pray your dreams come true. Yes. Um, and I want to let Maya shut down the show and ask you the final question. Okay. But I'm grateful for you being here. Thank you Thank so much. Thank you so much for having me. Okay. <laughs> I had so much fun too. So my final question would be, given that you've had your journey, beautiful struggles through through it all, what would you tell like an artist who's starting out right now? Because see you, you've started from high school, from the festival, from all that to now to 2021. Maybe there's an artist who's just started in year to do juju. And they're like, you know what, this is not it. Because right now, um, the scene is populated maybe with one kind of genre. Yeah. What would you tell like that artist like this is what you need to do? Yeah. Take away. Well in a depend mm-hmm. in a depend uh I guess no is mm-hmm. You know it's easy to tell someone, oh you go find people who can help you but you know they don't they start, yeah. Mm-hmm. You know? Um I would say actually I would say like to to and just find like live performances. Mm-hmm. You're most likely to find other guys who are also starting out. Mm-hmm. That's how I think we found each other. Mm-hmm. Like um 
he was just performing ukwili as in because I remember I remember when Q was starting out I think Pia had to be kwanga in anime at that time yeah. mm-hmm. so we were like really like tired to just go for this gig going mm-hmm. for each other's gigs and mm-hmm. then when you have that kind of support mm-hmm. you also feel like you know you're not alone even in this journey and everything else but also patience Okay. Things are not gonna work out in a year. Yeah. No, so the day I've had your journey and yeah. we have to right. It's not Umeni Tosh. Wow. It was not, it's not at the Twitter video. Yeah, it's album. A and that's why That's why we talk about the story because it's not Twitter. It's it's not that. I have to I have to all those years in the Nipamota journey, but your mindset in a style in Nipata. So it's also like the growth in a side year. Mm-hmm. Imagine if you got like Umeni in 2007. Where would you be now? You'd be fucked. Yeah, 14 years later, you'd be. You know. I'm actually glad it came right now. Right, now, right, right now, my mind is like ready for, for music for stuff. Then okay. I was like, that's. You are less mature uh-huh. in, in my thinking mm-hmm. and and the it was a hard making and uh-huh. yeah I would have I would have fucked up the opportunity mm-hmm. if it came to me at an early yeah. time. Yeah. Yeah. No, and and I, and I do, do you know the thing you deserve this opportunity. You you're ready for this opportunity in terms of your journey. Like, and that's what I'm saying. We can't talk to you and not talk about everything that's happened because it's pointless. We become here to sell a false lie and say, yeah, you wake up and then you. And then that's bullshit. Yeah, that's that's fucking true. lies. Don't fucking lie to the fucking world. Okay. Like your journey is so important because someone would never even think of going to the academy. You know, but it, there's a process to things. There, there's a, there's a, yeah, trust the process also. Mm-hmm. Trust the process and trust your gut instinct as well. Alright, that would, would go a long way. Yeah, really to that, we're going to wish you more life because if you wish you more life and you're going to live long, we're going to get more music. Yes. So Project na kujalini to be determined. Okay. <laughs> yes. But as I'm saying, sana. Thank you for coming to me. No, yes, I think we're going to sana. Actually, I've taken. Adu 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 the tosheka. No, like as a good tosheka, this is a good interview. Like, yeah. Like go extend. We don't extend normally. We don't extend unless it's like just. Ah, oh, thank you guys so much. It's like the, the energy is built. So like this, like I said, thank you for coming through. Thank you so much. Shout out to the world for listening. We'll be back tomorrow at five pm. Listen to two five four express radio two five four two five four two four seven. Let's get it. Good night. Good night. Two five four radio radio. Good night. (laughs) Good night, world. The United States Border Patrol has exciting and rewarding career opportunities with the nation's largest law enforcement organization. Earn great pay, outstanding federal benefits, and up to $20,000 in recruitment incentives. Learn more online at cbp.gov slash career slash USBP.